We introduced you to Gabe Capel last month as he was preparing to start his freshman year with a full ride at UNC. Now he says he feels like he and his classmates can't catch a break. I just wish this year could have been different. He got the call this morning that his parents want him back home in Rockingham County. He knew it was only a matter of time before he would leave Chapel Hill. My roommate, his friend, tested positive for the virus Saturday. So I got, I just get paranoid easy when it comes to stuff like this. Capel has Crohn's disease and knows he's more at risk for coronavirus. He says the university is asking students who can leave on campus housing to do so, and he canceled his housing contract, but for others, it's not that simple. I signed my lease last year, so I didn't, there was no predicting that this was going to happen. Isabel Reyna's classes are all online, but she is staying in Chapel Hill since she is paying for an off-campus apartment. I can't go to class. I'm not really going to be on campus. I don't want to be holed up in my little apartment all day long. I'd rather be at home with my family. Meanwhile, she says students are still paying tuition and campus fees. I can only imagine what they're going through. The UNC system says the changes at Chapel Hill are not affecting other colleges like UNC Greensboro, but Capel worries it's only a matter of time. I thought that everybody at Chapel Hill would be good as long as we wore masks, but that proved me wrong. Grace Holland, WFMY News 2.